This is Barbeted Skincare Routine. I'm going to be telling you guys all the products I used to get my skin clear and popping like this, and products that you can also use to get your skin popping. So let's go. For cleanser, I alternate between this Hibiscus Naturals, Neem, Turmeric, and Lemon face wash and NY Clear Skin Brightening Black Soap. So if you have a dry skin, don't use black soap on your face. I'm going to try and link all the products in my bio, and also if you want to make, if you want to buy any of them, you can just message me on whatsapp to the link to my bio so i'm going to be honest with you guys i'm not really a fan of this one after i'm done with it i'm not going to use it anymore i'm going to go back to the first one why because of the smell it smells like raw turmeric that's my only problem with it it actually washes and cleans its face very well it's just that i don't like the smell after i'm done using this one i'm going to go back to this one it's also for from by the same brand but this one is the carrot and rose seed this one is the carrot and rose hip seed version. Just see how that the two containers are. But I've really used the life out of this. <laughs> and this black soap contains a lot of benefits for your skin. Contains turmeric, contains carrot oil, collagen extract, all that great stuff. If you have a dry skin, I would advise you to use a cream-based or milk-based cleanser rather than a foaming cleanser. A good one is the CeraVe cream to foam or CeraVe hydrating cleanser next is toners currently don't use any toners in my routine but i'm expecting to one from a website called yesterday and another one from the Logica very soon so after i receive them i will use them and i'll drop my review to follow me if you would like to see that now based on the experience i'm going to recommend four toners to you guys it's well toner contains liquorice it balances the pH of your skin isn't tree hyaluronic toner coarser x name is essence they are all they are alcohol free centella toner these toners are very popular in the skincare community and so many people have gotten positive results with them another toner you can try is this ny clear skin oil control toner if you have an oily skin and you want to control excessive oil production on your face this toner will help you do just that for serums and treatments during the day i use this the ordinary 10 percent niacinamide plus one percent zinc like it really helps with controlling excess oils for those who have oily skin it's great for acne blemishes and controlling inflammation this apple vet cream and the ny clear skin anti-spot cream those are my nighttime treatments i use this one for fungal acne and i use the ny clear skin as a spot treatment for my dark spots i don't apply it all over my face i just apply it directly on the spot now, this is a steroid cream so i'll advise you to do your research before using it because there are rules regarding using steroid creams so it actually light this actually lightens the skin so i don't want it lightening my skin each time i want to use it so i applying it directly on the areas where i have fungi acne the areas like my forehead my cheeks here are my chin if you don't want to use a steroid cream and you have fungal acne you can also use Nizora shampoo as a face mask three to four times a week but if you decide to use this steroid cream because it is way way cheaper then just be careful baby girl i'm planning on incorporating a retinol into my skincare routine for anti-aging so i ordered for the ordinary one percent retinol in squalene and i can't wait to get it eye cream i normally don't use any eye cream because i believe that you don't need a special cream for your eye if you don't have any issues around your eye your moisturizer is good enough to also apply around your eyes but i've been noticing that the area around my eyes i'm starting getting darker so i'm planning on getting an eye cream that brightens my eyes so i'm going to recommend you use good molecules yeba wake up eye cream for moisturizer i've been using this ny clear skin niacinamide glow face milk contains niacinamide hyaluronic acid blueberry extract and kojic acid other moisturizers you can try is you can try this simple hydrating light moisturizer if you have an oily skin then the simple hydrating rich moisturizer if you have a dry skin another moisturizer you can go for is the sunjong two times intensive barrier cream you can also go for the la roche posay sika balm for my lips I alternate between this vaseline rosy lip therapy and this lip gloss any this one's called squeeze and shine but any good lip gloss any good non-sticky lip gloss will do actually i use this vaseline lip therapy during the dry weather and i use this one during the times where the weather is not so dry 
if i use this vaseline lip therapy when the weather is not dry it's gonna feel heavy and leave one and leave like a white yucky film on my lip i don't know if i'm the only one who experiences that like my lip easily peels and then there's this white thing that just forms there comment below if you also experience that a lip product i would love to try out and i also recommend that you try too it's the laneige sleeping lip max like it makes lips so soft another lip product i would love to try out is the clarins lip oil i've heard so many good things and so many positive and so many positive reviews about these two products so yeah for sunscreen i'm currently using gavia sunblock but that's because i'm waiting for my other sunscreens to arrive from yes style website and jumia i ordered for kamake sunscreen appeal sunscreen bio uv to be lab master adjacent sunscreen i'll give a review on all the sunscreens i use in another video i also exfoliate my skin two times a week using this ny clear skin aha a bha exfoliating gel mask at night um i used to use this the ordinary 30 percent aha plus two percent bha uh, mask it's finished right now it's red inside i really like this one i feel like this one was so great on my skin but don't use if you're a beginner and only use if you do like if you're not a first time acid user so you don't hurt your skin i'll try to link everything in my bio also if you want to make an order you can also message me on whatsapp through the link in my bio follow me for more skincare tips and subscribe to my youtube channel for more skincare tips